Bitcoin reverses its decline and the U.S. government deems that no NFT-specific legislation is needed for now. You're watching Coindesk Daily. I'm your host, Jen Sinassi. Bitcoin reversed Tuesday's decline to climb up above $73,000 today. Some observers are saying that Bitcoin's price behavior suggests that institutional investors are leading market activity. The gains followed a record day of ETF inflows in terms of dollars and Bitcoin. Data tracked by BitMEX research shows that spot Bitcoin ETFs took in over a billion dollars worth of net inflows on Tuesday, surpassing the February record. Bitcoin is at around $72,000 as of 10 a.m. Eastern Time, and the Coindesk 20 index is relatively flat at 2736. The Ethereum blockchain has successfully completed the Denkun upgrade. The upgrade is designed to usher in a new era of cheaper fees for the growing array of auxiliary networks that operate on top of Ethereum known as Layer 2 rollups. The Denkun upgrade has been planned for years, but it was delayed due to some engineering concerns. Since then, developers have tested the package on three separate networks, and most of those ran smoothly. Ether is at just below $4,000 as of 10 a.m. Eastern Time. And the U.S. government has concluded that no NFT-specific legislation is needed. A 112-page government study found that current intellectual property laws are adequate to deal with concerns about copyright and trademark infringement associated with NFTs. The stakeholders said they don't believe changes are needed at this time and that any NFT-specific legislation might be premature. That's a wrap for Coindesk Daily Today. Get more updates on Coindesk.com and we'll see you next time.